You ready for the tour? I'm always ready, man. I want to see my fans. All y'all better be out there. I already told y'all, when I come to your city, you better pop out. We finna turn up at Florence and see the tour. You know what I'm saying? Meet and greet. Catch your boy Nunu in Louisiana. Hey, Milwaukee might be the biggest one. Just watch what I say. Let's bet. Any any city that anybody lives in, my city is gonna be the biggest. Y'all ain't seen this side of me, man. I'm finna turn up, man. It's a whole new year, a whole new me. I'm finna turn up for y'all. I ain't seen y'all in I don't know how long. You know what I'm saying? We ain't been in tour in what a year. Oh, they kissing. Oh, they kissing. Oh. Chris and Neil, they was in there kissing. They act like I didn't see it. I heard it and I seen it with my with my four eyes. I hope y'all have fun season two. I ain't riding on the bus with these motherfuckers. Is it true that you guys wanted to get Liberty drunk so you guys could fight her? Chris, did you tell Lena and Cam to fight for you? Viewers want to know why you were filming the fight and your close friends instead of breaking it up. <coughs> Welcome to Influencer City Season 1 Reunion. As you can see today, a few of the castmates have decided to not be in attendance. But we are still very excited to see Chrissy, Angel, Eli, Cam, Crache, Jacob, Nunu, Debo, Chris, and Nia. When Nunu arrived to the Influencer City House, the short interaction between Angel and Nunu was noticeably so, awkward. So, Angel, how did you feel about being in a house with your ex? Honestly, I don't know. We haven't talked since we broke up, so there's really nothing there. I mean, I'm going on, he moved on. Okay, so that was the first time you guys saw each other since your birthday? Um, yeah. Nunu, how did you feel about being in that same yeah, house with your ex? Uh, yeah, like, you see? <coughs> Uh, let me see. I really, like, really, you know. I really, I don't know. I didn't really, like, care type shit like that. I don't be feeling no type of way to people. Okay, Dennis, why did you vote Angel out of the house? Yeah, why did you vote me out of the house? <laughs> I was just doing it just to be funny. Oh, just, just for something, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Angel, how did that make you feel? I mean, he didn't even own up to it and say it. Um, I had to find out through everybody else, but he now that it's out, I mean, yeah, he didn't have to do it. No, 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 because I, I didn't, I didn't know. Right. Yeah. That, that's that. I mean, I had to be back, I had to be back. Well, after being in the house together, are you guys cordial again? Friends, maybe? Viewers were enjoying the collapse between the two groups, and in a blink of an eye, there was a birthday brawl. So, why did Nunu and Debo actually fight? Ah, oh, shit, here we go. All right, so, really, I just felt like it was a misunderstanding, you know what I'm saying? I don't know if it was over that YouTube video that we had did, where we said, um, I'm not gonna repeat what we said, you know what we said, but. Wait, what did y'all say? I don't know. Yeah, what did y'all say? Say it. Say it to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh, was it that Smash the Pass video? Or did y'all say, oh, Smash me? Oh, so, okay, why? Type shit, so. I don't know if it was that. Said. Yeah, right. So, I don't know if it was that or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because after that, you know, we had seen you and shit. And, you know, it was cool, but then I don't know if you had. You made a TikTok saying anybody that speak on your ex, buck, buck, buck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> So I'm like, is he talking about us? I didn't, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. I was, you did? I was, I was saying, I was doing a little smack. I was doing a little smack thing. I didn't do that right now. I didn't know how to take that. So I just felt like, all right, if it's a problem, I ain't saying it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So what did you guys do after that? Did you guys go to the bar? Did you go to the club? 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 Acting like we're looking at each other, but we acting like we ain't know each other and we got a problem, why not settle it right up? And then, you know, I ain't know how you was feeling that day because the shit didn't go too well. I ain't, you know, I don't know how you was feeling, but I just felt like you weren't, you weren't trying to hit me out, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And just, you know, but it's all good, though. No, that shit, that shit over with, you know what I'm saying? Niggas get past shit every day. <laughs> <laughs> so, did y'all ever really squash it or are you just saying that now? Yeah. Oh. We love to see that you guys seem to have left all of that behind you. What helped the Rated R boys and the PMG boys get cool again? There was a lot of behind the scenes, behind the camera, you know, like us just talking, you know what I'm saying, coming to agreements, talk, you know what I'm saying, just maturing or whatever. So, yeah. Because it was really over some bullshit, like, 
fuck is we beefing over that shit, but <laughs> and then we got all these motherfuckers watching us. It's like, come on, man. Why not get money together? Hmm. All right. I got a lot of lip smacking. What's the problem? No, next question. There was plenty of drama in the house to go around, from Lena and Nunu's water fight, Lena and Eli's fight, Liberty and Angel. To the infamous love triangle between Kibo, Yellow Barney, and Brooklyn. Oh, yeah, where's Brooklyn and Yanni? I thought they were coming. Yeah, they couldn't be in attendance, but, you know, we showing love to y'all. Shout out to y'all. Yeah, I'll talk with you. Debo, are you and Brooklyn in a relationship? <laughs> no. No, we are not. Mm. Do you guys only post this uh, couple content for entertainment purposes only? Nah, really. <laughs> so y'all together. Come on, man, let me talk, let me talk, let me talk. So really, man, you know what I'm saying? We, we know like, we, we know the people who like to see us together, but at the end of the day, all, all the YouTube and, and TikTok shit aside, social media aside, we have established a bond that is unbreakable. So that shit, it really just shows on camera. You know what I'm saying? That don't mean we gotta be in a relationship for that. <clears throat> like, it might look like it, you know what I'm saying? But we not. So why did you let Yellow Barbie come between? She ain't coming between shit. <laughs> well, <laughs> she ain't that was gonna fight. Man, look. And you were saying this, but don't fight. Man, I was trying to break it up. That's what I'm saying. What the fuck I was supposed to say? It's the heat Why of the moment. Why are you messing around with two people about the same time? Talking about messing around. I wasn't messing See, around with y'all. Y'all in the room with each other. Any dirt. Bruh, if you go back, if we go back, literally, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Come on, dude. <laughs> Look, she wanted to talk. I don't know what the fuck she wanted to talk about, but she wanted to talk. And it was too much going on downstairs. So I so, to go talk in the bathroom. In the room, oh. nigga. <laughs> in the room. And Brooklyn was being Brooklyn. Okay. Y'all know how that be. So shit escalated. And then Yella, she was kind of being over the top two. Both. So you don't think he was kind of flirting with Yella? It did look like I y'all mean, was shit, flirting. Whatever it looked like it is. <laughs> Okay, now this is a question from the fans. Smash, Mary, kill, Brooklyn, Jada, or Yellow Barbie? Damn. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, say it again. Smash, <laughs> Mary, or kill. <laughs> no, I swear to God, I'm thinking that was like a question for everybody or something. No, it's for you, Debo. It's just for you. Smash, Mary, kill, Brooklyn, Jada, or Yellow Barbie? Jada. Yeah. Oh. No. <laughs> uh, hmm. I'ma kill yellow. Um, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a definitely pass Jada, and you know, Mary Brooke. I don't think that was how to, how to game work. Although Liberty isn't here to tell her side of things, viewers would love to hear from Chrissy and Angel. Is it true that you guys wanted to get Liberty drunk so you guys could fight her? I'm trying to see what we need to get her drunk to fight her for. Liberty showed them a video of De Niro saying, we did do that, but then you talked to her and she said we didn't. Because we didn't even get drunk that night because we're trying to stand on our 10 just in case we had the fight. Nobody even got drunk. I mean, we was not drinking with her. We not her friend. Ain't no friendly, none of this. So what is the real beef between you guys and Liberty? She said she was going to slap me because somebody told her that I said I was going to slap her. Yeah, you need the money. Then got caught on camera saying that she didn't say that, but she said that to me. So, I mean, if you were scared, just say that. But after that, she lied and said we tried to get her drunk. Like, what are you lying for? What are you, like, I feel like she's just crazy. She's Thank weird. You. Like, she like attention. That's really what she likes. So next time. Do you guys think you could ever work it out with Liberty and be friends? No. No. She, no. she too weird. She just need that one little yeah. fade. I mean, she was cool at first. She was cool at first. She was chilling. Everybody was just vibing. Then it's like after the drama started going on and the show was over with, she just started 
I guess she got mad because how she looked on camera. Nobody was really fucking with her. Everybody said yeah, she Yeah, because we talked it out as, like, grown women. We talked all that Literally, out. it wasn't on camera. Nobody seen that, but we talked. Everybody did a whole little group hug. So like, we was good. How y'all talk it out? She came in the room. She apologized. And it was like, you know, it was cool, whatever. Then we Couple really little started, tears was dropped. Exactly. We started talking about our past. Yeah. She was like, I really fuck with you. Y'all, she was following Chrissy around the whole house. Like, I went to the store. She was in the back seat. Like, she, she was, was like, Chrissy, you, know, you my new yeah. friend. All up on her. I'm like, hold up. Back up. So, like, yeah. She all over her. You was just not messing with her. Trying to fight. One night of fun for both the girls and the guys quickly turned into a boxing match, almost leaving Chris with a black eye. <laughs> <laughs> Elena was quick to jump to his defense, which is what good friends do. But viewers want to know, Chris, did you tell Lena and Cam to fight for you? I did not tell Lena or Cam to fight for me. I specifically said on the phone, 4K camera, plenty of times. It is okay. It was an accident. I'm, I'm good. Yeah, we good. It's all good. You feel me? It's cool. Y'all cool. Whole time, like motherfuckers, you know they. No, 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 fuck it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm, I'm gonna fight. I'm, I mean, I'm, I mean, shit is good. It's an accident. I mean, I don't know. I ain't really know what to say. Like, I mean, I was cool. I, it wasn't like I was right there. Like, damn, four ass hit me about my shit. <laughs> oh, damn, somebody get her ass. Four. You know, I'm, I wouldn't even know that. I'm like, I'm like, bro, her ass just hit me, bro. I know it's a fucking. I know they was just fighting. I was my fault because I'm in the middle. I, what the fuck, I'm trying to break up a girl fight for it. So, you know what I'm saying? That was my fault for even going in that anyway. So, you know, I'm like, in my, in my head, I'm like, man, it was an accident. I don't know if I need to fight her for that, especially if she just lost at that moment. Like, ain't no reason for her to get fight again. Ain't no point. You hear me? This turned out to be the calm before the storm because the very next night seemed to be the real boxing match. It's been so many rumors going around with talks of there being a possible setup. Debo, Chris, and Eli, did you guys know the girls who came to fight that night? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, wait, 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 let me say something. Wait, wait hold on, re-ask that. I didn't hear that clearly. Let me say something before you ask that question. Also, with that, I wanted to say I really appreciate Cam and Lena for even stepping that hard, because honestly, in my head, I wasn't thinking nobody was even going to be like over on that to be stepping behind me like that with a situation like that. So it just caught me off guard too. So I'm like, damn, is they like for real? Or is this like for the camera? Like, I'm trying to see like, you get what I'm saying? So I'm like, all right, damn, they, they really trying to tee up behind me. So I'm like, I'm trying to tell them chill and shit. So I just wanted to say that I, I do appreciate that, but it, it was like, it just got out of hand and it, it just got turned into a different situation quick. It was like, what's this even like, are you even trying to fight them for me anymore? Or are you trying to fight? It, it, it got blurred lines real fast. It was like, damn, what is the reason? Like, because I'm cool. Like, I'm, I'm cool at this point. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm cool. You fit. <laughs> Man, next question. Viewers want to know why you were filming the fight and your close friends instead of breaking it up. <clears throat> I was breaking it up. But um, I was also filming. But, man. Uh, so, basically, about that. I was filming the shit. Just Not, tell him, the just day before, him. he was already filming. I was just filming everything, you know what I'm saying, on my story to just get the whole full experience of the house, you feel me? That's why I said everybody saying the floors of the city busting, <laughs> because everybody was seeing what was going on in the house. Now, me recording the fights, I was recording the fights, but I was still <laughs> trying to get that shit. But I feel like I was, when I was recording the night of the, the, the big fight, you know what I'm saying, I feel like... I was just, I was going out there thinking something. And, you know, just because, you know, shit ain't go, niggas may, how niggas may expect it, I feel like it was a problem. So, I could say I shouldn't have been, I should have just been mindful of what I was recording. Cause I, you know, heat of the moment, I'm recording, but I ain't even, I'm, I'm just watching, I ain't even realizing I'm recording still, but I am. So I'm just really not even thinking like, I. Right, I'm recording this. I'm just recording it then. So it, uh, you know, won't go nowhere. I just put, put it in my close friends. And I wasn't mindful of everything I was recording. You know what I'm saying? I, I just have a question. Did anybody understand anything this nigga just said? <laughs> <laughs> because I swear to God, I just sat there so confused. Somebody asked like a 
Because <laughs> <laughs> what? I was recording, but I was breaking it up. But I was just, I was. <laughs> that was all. Bro, he was just supposed to, bro. You got, you got. Yeah. Up in the yeah, 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 yeah. What the fuck else I need to say? Yeah, explain it to the people so they can understand. Okay, like I, I was just, I was, I wasn't really realizing what I was recording. You know what I'm saying? So as I was recording, I'm just, as soon as I'm just letting it roll and then it'll stop and I put it in my close friends, not realizing. You know what I'm saying? I know everybody didn't hear the moment where they doing something, they don't realize they doing something. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it was. Caught up in the moment. So you feel like you should not have recorded now? Or do you feel like it's still like, shit, you would have been recording like, regardless? Hmm. I mean, they were pardon me? Before too. Right, so it's like, uh, but it's like, you know, just because somebody doing something, I mean. So the thing was like, everybody wasn't getting them, everybody, everybody was getting them. Debo bad. Because you're supposed to be more girls. I think stepping for them. Didn't you say something on top of the video? No. Now let me clarify that. And it was like. No, no, no. no. <laughs> that what was, was that? The girls. The girls was in his close friend. Well, well, one screen one recorded girl, it. One of the girls. One of the girls was in his close friend and screen recorded it and posted that. And put so her own words. Oh, right. So it looked like. And then okay. she put the action. She put the words in his video. I think that was a main reason they were mad too because I seen that and I was like, what the fuck? And motherfuckers cut out, like when they posted this shit and put, put it on the T page or whatever, they screenshot it and cut out the fact that Shorty posted the right. screen works so it made it look like it was Debo and put it, the ad on there. That was what the miscommunication was, but right. that's what crazy. Yeah, I feel like that's what everybody was really mad about. So, I say that to I'm like, whoa. Is, is the video being recorded on the issue because it looks like she lost, it would it have been an issue if she would have like won? And, you know, I'm just keeping it a buck, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with motherfuckers, but I feel like this, if the situation probably would have went there, really shit, motherfuckers would have been mad. But I mean, if it, was like, if it was vice versa, like it was you, and it was you in a fight, yeah, do you think I you would have been mad? It's like, I already know what to expect. But you can't, you can't, you can't you know expect that this to fight. Like, I know what the it's fuck, like I know what the fuck happened when motherfuckers fight. I exactly. know what I'm getting myself into when I'm fighting in front of a bunch of motherfuckers. Exactly. And I know what I'm getting myself into when I'm bumping my gun <laughs> and motherfuckers in, a lot, in front of a lot of motherfuckers with cameras around. We so it's just like, you know what you get yourself into. So at the end of the day, I know what I'd be getting myself into. <clears> so whatever the fuck happens, it happens, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Angel, viewers would like to know why you did not jump into the fight. Me personally, um, I mean, me, myself, if I'm bumping my nose with somebody and somebody say, okay, fight me, and I agree to get out there and fight, we're going to fight. I don't expect nobody to jump in for me. I don't expect nobody to help me. So, I mean, if I was in their shoes, I wouldn't be mad. So, nobody brought it to my attention that they was mad at me. So, I don't, I mean, the fans can say what they want to say. She didn't say she was mad at me. We didn't feel no type of way because I feel like if she was in my shoes, I mean, if I was in her shoes, I wouldn't expect nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, cl we cool, we close, but you know what I'm saying? That's just what it is. So does anyone actually know who sent those text messages to the girl about fighting and the brother that passed away? Anonymous. No. Yeah, you said what? Anonymous. Anonymous. Yeah, we don't know who did Yeah, I don't know who did that. I mean, I mean didn't they say, well, they said it was Lena, but Lena said it wasn't, so, I mean, at this point, if she don't got no real receipts to show that it was her, I feel like, it's dead. Yeah, it was from a text me now number, right? A green and messages. Supposedly. Yeah. Yeah. Supposedly. Yeah. Right. That was their main reason. Okay, oh, shortly know? after this fight, we don't see Cam on the show as much anymore. She did post a YouTube video telling her side of the story. She mentioned that she was hurt by Chris, Eli, and Debo, that they didn't help break up the fight right away, and that Debo protected Brooklyn from fighting. Everybody telling Debo? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I ain't even watch our YouTube video, so shit. 
I don't read up too much about <laughs> shit. <laughs> I didn't think it funny as hell. But for real though, um, yeah, um, man, I feel like it's old, man. The fight happened. It is what it is. You said what you had to say about it. Oh, shit. She said she felt some type of way that we didn't help break up the fight. Now, in my head, when all of this shit going, was going on, the night before, there was a lot of people talking a lot of shit about wanting to fight and I don't give a fuck, I'm still trying to fight, I don't care. I'm like, she already lost, she, she you know what I'm saying, motherfucker. No, no, I, I still wanna fight, I'm sorry, I want my ones, I want my ones. And so the girls pulled back up and they specifically pulled up and said, I want Lena, Liberty, and Cam. I don't know how they found out about y'all names, that's between y'all and them. But they pulled up and they said that, and they said their reasoning. And then another girl said that, oh yeah. Oh, cause in the text now messages from the night before, somebody said, whoever said, whoever said, the whoever sent the text now messages, they said, oh yeah, and Cam said she wants your head. So the girl replied, was like, okay, bet. So they pulled up the next day, like, all right, bet. You know what I'm saying? They like, all right, bet, we want y'all. So in my head, not knowing what's gonna happen afterwards, I'm thinking motherfuckers want they ones. I'm like, all right, bet y'all finna get y'all ones. But it's on Patreon, you get what I'm saying, on episode, what, six or something. I don't know if y'all can see the full fight 4K. Um, it was like, the shit happened quick as fuck. Yeah, like, 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 you can see it literally happened all in seven seconds, G. Mind you, I'm all the way by the, I'm, I'm by the curb. Everybody by the curb. And the fight started by the garage, like, when the whole shit happened, everybody already back. So we like, oh shit, the mama running up. Wait, hold on, wait, let me go. You know what I'm saying? So motherfuckers, all right, bet. Now we in the mix. Personally, I do feel like I could have did a lot more to help. That's how that was going. Cam breaking that shit up. You get what I'm saying? Another thing. <laughs> that was off camera. I told Cam, G, first of all, you know your mama is leaving you and in, in our hands when you around us, folks. Just off the fact that we've been so close for so long. So, well, I, I told her, like, I can't let you fight. You reinstated to me. My mama said, why y'all ain't let me whoop her ass? So I'm like, all right, what the fuck my word mean against your mama word? So I'm gonna let you do what you gonna do. Is, you Imagine, know what I'm saying? That's the night before the fight. So we like, okay, if this, I, you want your one, it's been like, I don't know, you know what I'm saying? So. That's, that's for that, the, the mama in the jumping situation. That shit happened really, really fast. Motherfuckers broke it up as good as we can. Like, that, okay, that situation, you got us. Like, okay, cool, that was that. Was that. As, of, as for the next, the, like, the second fight for, with her when she was by the car, I promise to God, it did not look like she was like losing that, that fight for real to me. I, I'm looking at it, I'm looking, I'm, I'm spreading the shit. I'm like, all right, babe, finna, she finna get her fair one. This is, this is what they want. This is the girl that said she wanted Cam. This is the girl that Cam said she was talking to the night before. So I'm thinking they finna get their gig and they want. I'm, I swear I'm not thinking motherfuckers after that finna be like, oh damn, you ain't break it up. You. Just don't, they just didn't get it on Cam. It's cool. I'm, they didn't get none of that on Cam. I don't know how much, like what, like how much motherfuckers wanted us to get in there. Did they want us to get in there grabbing the girl, swinging? Y'all know we can't do that, bro. We is niggas, G. I'm sure they understand. Do they, bro? Do 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 y'all understand? That's another reason why I didn't jump in. Like them girls came to fight specifically for people. When they called them out, they stepped to the plate and fought. Like they knew it's how to I don't know why everybody was calling me. I was at <laughs> home. I just got and I was well, I was already on the way. And they were like, you need to get here right now. Like get here right now. And I'm like, what's gonna happen? They're like, they finna pull up. That's another pull up. reason why I jumped like, in, because they was already I ain't gonna lie. They was out of there. Like, they needed him. Like, they needed that. So I had to do a little one-two. But when I seen they steady wanted to fight, when we already was trying to, like, everybody go home, like, Nina them not here with the whoop. They steady wanted to fight. Lena, and not, Lena saying she wanted her one. Cam, everybody wanted they one. Like, it wasn't Exactly. Nothing everybody nothing started fighting. And when it got too serious, I feel like we did, well, I don't know if we did good enough, but we did a good job to breaking it up. And when we start breaking up, they run it, they still run it back at the And home. I feel like the you boys the that was on the side, motherfucker, like motherfuckers, we, we can't say too much, but like motherfuckers on the side, but we protecting the whole facility, making sure 
not, not shit escal like shit not escalating. It was a girl fight. Like we kept it a girl fight. Like, oh, I got a question. Did y'all hear when the boy came and uh, broke Fendi windows? Did y'all hear that? Y'all didn't think to go check on it or nothing. We didn't know what they had. Like we was just like we didn't know what they was on. And, and I'm not know, I stupid. Type of way if that was my car, y'all ain't go out there and tell them niggas to get the fuck out of my car. But okay. So well. <laughs> See, it really played out like, boom, they pulled back up because they had, they dipped it, well, they, because, you know, shit got hot. The police pulled up to the crib. Man, he told them, like, nah, nothing was going on. Like, he, he ain't tell them that shit was going on. Boom, they pulled back up on bullshit, but they didn't come all the way to the crib. I guess, I don't know how them niggas knew his car, but they hopped out the car, did what he did. Hit the car, broke the window, whatever. Hop back in the car and they skirted off. So it was like. Yeah. What the fuck, motherfuckers want us to do? What do y'all think y'all could have did to stop that? Shit. Mm. <clears throat> I want you to say. I want you to talk. First of all, that ain't got nothing to do with me at all. So, yeah, literally. <laughs> <laughs> Where's that with Fanny? Boom. After the fight, the girls said, I got a nigga for you. I got people for you, bet. Mm, okay, yeah. Motherfuckers leave, and then Fendi and them leave. I guess, the, I don't know why the car is still there. I guess the car is still there. Motherfuckers pull back up, looking for Fendi. Let's say, I don't want to over-exaggerate. Let's say 20 people. Cause I don't want to over exaggerate. I would say thirty because that's how that's what it sounded like and that's what it looked no, like. No, they was on live. It was like two cars. We seen the live. We seen no, the cars. It was that. It was. It was two cars. They was on live. Because Nunu, Nunu, Nunu. That's why I don't know why Cam said we won. We didn't have none because we had some. But you know anyway, what I'm okay, bro. It was just bro. the fact that how many motherfuckers bro. it was. Listen, y'all seen the people where they was on live in the front. It was like two cars in the front, but it was like. Four cars in the backyard pulled up on the side, like yeah, y'all didn't see that because and it was and it was straight straight niggas like straight niggas in the back. It was like yeah yeah who hit my sister who touched my sister, them and then they had you know the other people that was in the front banging on the window looking for Fendi. You see what I'm saying? So yeah, but y'all ain't y'all ain't know that though. So okay. so it was it was the uh, people they, it was the people had, it, it was the like people like looking for Fendi in the front. And then it was just like, just niggas out in the backyard, just back there. You know what I'm saying? They were trying to climb the gate on some ugly shit. So I feel like everybody lived, like everybody that did leave, I feel like they lived because they felt unsafe after that fight. We had to stay there and deal with that, and like we didn't even start it. Like you know what I'm saying? But we had to lay out. Yeah, we had to stay back. Everybody else left. You know what I'm saying? We. we yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I wasn't there, but like, in my opinion, I don't see how anybody can be mad at anybody because technically, all of this started over a situation that didn't have to start. If they would have just respected your word and left it alone, it would have never got to this point. And secondly, thirdly, whoever sent the messages is technically who put all of y'all in danger. So it doesn't matter who did what or who got jumped by who, y'all all need to be mad at whoever sent the message because that's who put y'all in danger. I like Cam, so I do understand her perspective, but this is fighting. Like, you can't say, oh, I'm going to go punch her twice and then break it up. Okay. It's a fight. If you get into a fight, there's no limit to how many times somebody could hit Ain't you no in a fight. Like, like, it's a fight. So, if she wanted security, she should have never went out there to fight. Like, it's kind of just simple, honestly. Good. Good break time. So, it was some guys that called your phone. Yeah, they called my phone, um, like... Yeah, here did I'm gonna call her. And she's trying to act like she didn't know. She literally, I called her. Oh, that's why you took that on and said, Liberty, yes, you know them girls. Liberty was Ooh. like, <coughs> Man. Who was that? Who the hell knows? Oh, them the ones people. That's so these some niggas. So that's these some niggas. niggas. Hey, he gonna die. I'm God. Who is that? Oh, hell no. Y'all want me to answer this bitch? They come back over here. They gonna die. I'm God. Play that. What you hanging What you hanging up for? Pussy. So what up? Now you 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 being messy, huh? What you talking about? 
You being messy, huh? You man, it's a female fight. Y'all niggas getting some female drama. It's a whole drama. bunch of niggas on there one ain't side. There ain't nothing. Ain't now nigga. Yeah, what about on. this female drama, gang? If y'all trying to get in this nah, female beef, that's some whole ass shit, bro. Oh, I'm gonna get the drop from old girl. Don't worry. All right, slide through, bitch. Oh, we gonna drop a bag on your head. Oh, you see how females can get out there and squabble with a fight? We gonna fight, we gonna fight. Bro. But he ain't gonna fight. Y'all so ready? Y'all so ready to get hyped? Y'all think a nigga gonna tell y'all they putting money on y'all head over the phone? These ain't no real street niggas. He putting money on my head. He don't even know what the fuck we look like. He not even know exactly. Come on, now, don't even let no nigga get y'all mad. Nigga, man. Everybody walking out this hall, a nigga not finna tell me he gonna kill me over the phone. Like if you really die. street, man. Tell me you, you bear that number. I ain't get nobody fucking. This shit don't even matter. They text my phone, send me they act, send me they act, send me they act. I'm not sending shit. What the fuck is you talking about? You saying I don't even get here. mad. They talking about nothing. Niggas not fighting no more. Niggas finna chill. You talking about chop a bag on your head. Yeah, yeah. yeah that means I know what that means. I know what that means. So let me go suit up. Way different, bro. Suit up for what? Some shit. I don't know. But uh, I don't know what the fuck them niggas were talking about. I know that. Cam be end up grabbing the phone and then spend that shit. Them boys was talking about they was gonna put a bag on his head, all that, for cause cause they thought we touched one of the females basically, and I was letting them niggas know like you not gonna do that. Like what's wrong with you, God? Like you not finna do that, nigga, over a girl fight? Like that's stupid. We get a round of applause for Chris. Hey. No. I just gotta say, like, if you go pop your stuff on the internet, like, come to the reunion so y'all can get that out the way. We didn't put our boxing matches, we didn't put up money, ain't nobody popped that. So I really feel like it's dead. If we ain't gonna fight, we both in Houston. We could set it up, but we ain't set it up, so it's dead now. Literally, this shit is dragging on. It's been how long? Two months? Like, um. Oh, why? Bro, She's into we, it? Like, I mean, I'm For once she lied on her oh, name yeah, on yeah, social yeah. media, like, like that's not going to make people look at you differently. Like, you don't do that. Drugging, too. Right. I gave you liquid yeah, to be trapped. What the fuck? So, this has nothing to do with the fight that we actually had or doesn't. This what? Us fight? Us fight? Yeah, us fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,
Was there any one person y'all didn't like working with or filming with? Um, my ex. <laughs> I felt like he was trying to beat me in all the games and then make it into, uh, yeah. Yeah. You? What about you? <clears throat> I ain't like filming with Trey and Liberty. Like, I just feel like it was just dry drama. I feel drama. like they weren't there when we were actually doing fun stuff, though. They were only there for the drama. Like, yeah. When we started doing it. But everybody else, they was great. I ain't gonna lie. Like, we had fun. They missed all the fun. Yeah, like, we had fun. So, outside of Liberty and her friend, do you have any problems with anyone else on the cast? Nah, I like all of them. They cool, they cool. Oh, me too? Mm -hmm. Um, no. <laughs> no. Who? Me? Yeah. I mean, everybody was cool. I, I mean, I didn't really get into it with nobody, so I mean, I'm cool on everybody. Except after the fact. Once we was in the house, wasn't nobody arguing with me. I didn't get into it with nobody. But once the shows came out and everybody started seeing how motherfuckers really is, that's when... People started making up lies and shit, and that's when everything got started with me. So. Okay, looking back on everything, is there anything you wish you would do differently on the show? Yeah, I wish I would have ran back downstairs and slapped Liberty when she said she was gonna slap me, but it's too late for that, so. Well, I was already at the top of the stairs, and I was trying to make sure Christian did it fight. I didn't even know she was gonna say that shit. Sound like Christian, bro, ignore what they saying. Come on, we just gonna go upstairs. Then she called me out, I'm like, bro, I'm trying to keep her from beating your ass. You gonna call me out? But yeah, I should have ran back downstairs. And, yeah. What about you? I feel like I should have never listened to nobody that was telling me keep my cool and <laughs> walk through the. <laughs> and just steady telling me like, just walk through the house. Because y'all like, don't know how this girl get. Like Liberty would have literally been in a hospital. But like, it's like some people they just need that you. one lesson. Like they need that one lesson. I'm I gonna, really was trying to save her, but. Can't save everybody. Yeah. That's everything I have. Okay. Um, why is it needed to do that? Um, what I was told is that she wanted to spend time with her mom today because it's her last day in town. So that's why I heard she didn't want to be here. That's what she told me. Any other remarks on season one? Um, no, I'm ready to go on tour. I am going to be selling my merch on tour. So, yeah, I got a little brand coming out of whatever. Yep. Okay. Will we be seeing you guys on season two? Okay. That's it. <laughs> What's funny? Yeah, I don't know if it's <laughs> oh. <laughs> if it's meant for me, y'all. Yeah, I'll be on there. If it's not, hey, it's just not my time. I'm gonna keep grinding as you should. It's up from here. So viewers want to know. Do you guys have feelings for each other? Or are you guys secretly dating? No, we are not secretly dating. This is my dog. Nothing more, nothing less. That's it. Okay. What about that YouTube video y'all kissed? When we kiss? You kiss me? Run the clip. Run the clip? Run the clip. They kissing. Oh, they kissing. When did I kiss you? I, I, I kissed you? I got a clip when you kissing me. You kissed me? I ain't never kiss you. Boy, I didn't kiss you. I don't, I don't kiss her. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who do y'all feel like was the messiest on the show? Who do I feel like was the messiest on the show? Mm-hmm. <laughs> huh. um, messy? I don't know, because I low-key was lost in the, like, the whole mix-up. So like when I like came to whenever stuff was happening, I'm just like looking there like, what's going on? So it's like, who the most messiest? I don't know. I don't know, who the most messiest? Uh, uh. He's trying to bite his tongue already. I say, I say either. Okay, so based off of the first like three episodes, it was Liberty. You know what I'm saying? Cause that was, that was crazy. But throughout like the whole thing, if y'all pay attention, De Niro. Messy? Are we talking messy or that was what? That question, answer it. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah messy, you never. Right. You wanna know why? You wanna know why? You wanna know why, Messi? She started everything. 
and did not fight. That was the messiest thing. Of Are we, are we finna get into this? All right, next question, gang. Oh. Okay, looking back, is there anything you two <laughs> wish you would do differently on the show? I wish I would have recorded a lot more no, YouTube videos. Because I was there, fuck all that drama, bro. I wish I would have recorded hella oh, YouTube bro, videos. I hate drama. That's why most of the time you see me, I'm in the cut just looking. I don't got time for it. That's too much energy, too much negative energy. I don't got time. And like the time... That we did have fun. It was fun. Nobody yeah. didn't get most of that on camera at all. Yeah, we was so having fun. Like, I wish we was having more time of that. Should have had that camera rolling. Nah, but that's what I would have done differently. Spent more time doing videos with everybody else. Getting to know everybody else for real. Everybody was just like, had their own love. Yeah, it was People too. Was it, it, was, it, was, it was getting weird. It was like, that drama was getting confused. And it was like, motherfuckers really, excuse me, didn't like each other in the house or something. Like, it was like awkward tension. Yeah. Then it, it started. It started breaking. It started like the tension started breaking once motherfuckers was leaving the house, and then we started having fun and shit. We was in that bitch doing obstacle courses and shit. Yeah. Okay. Is there any one person you didn't like on the show or like working with on the show? Um. I ain't even get to work with everybody, so it's like. Everybody, it's like certain people was like down to do videos. Other people just wasn't. It was just in a chilling. So it's like that's not what we came here for. Yeah, I have. I don't got no problem. With nobody, chill. Me neither. Okay, and if you had to pick one influencer to see on the next season, who would you want to see? That's like, a good like one influencer that's not I. Anybody. Oh, it yeah. had to be somebody funny. I got to think. I want it to be somebody, too. Like, somebody else that's funny to, like, enlighten more moods at a time. Just to avoid any type of unnecessary. We need somebody time. like Terry. Terry? We could use Terry. Or, yeah. Or, like, Curvo or something. Somebody funny. Yeah, you're right. Like, somebody Terry. funny. I'll say Terry. Oh, we need Misty. Misty. Wait, say the last part. How did you escape all of that? It wasn't really like escaping. I know how to like get involved in stuff that has something to do with me. None of that ain't have nothing to do with me, so why am I getting involved into it? Was she doing that too? Nah. So that's why it's just like, nah, for real. Listen, listen. So the whole messy stuff, I didn't see until like afterwards. So I ain't started seeing stuff from other people's point of view until after everything. So it was just like the whole time me and her was talking, we was Real cooling. Time. Yeah, we was cooling. I didn't know she was being messy until after everybody was pointing out about shit that happened. Right. Exactly. That's what I was saying. That's what I was saying. Like the first, like in the beginning, had hell no. Like you know, she was cooling. She was she was pretty cool. You know, it just happened once that kickback happened. And motherfuckers got like big dog with the motherfuckers that. So you felt like it was unnecessary that she kicked the girl out. Me personally, I respect. I respect that. She, Cause like. She but look, no, 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 look, look, think about it. Boom. The girl just lost the fight. She just lost three. It was three rounds that day. Mm -hmm. She lost all three rounds. They come back in the crib. Her and her friend. We knew the friend. You know what I'm saying. We didn't know her. She waited on her ride right there, sitting down, waiting on her ride. Everybody chilling, you know what I'm saying? And then, you know what I'm saying, De Niro come down and they was, she, she, she was just like... You feel like it was justified what she did? I don't know if it was justified, because it was like, I, I understand, okay, they still in the crib. I don't, I, I don't care if that, I don't care if you, if it was an accident, that's still my brother, kid, you gotta go. I get it a little bit. Okay, I get it, cool. They don't need to be, they don't need to be in the crib no more, but... No. Oh, what I'm saying, oh, yeah, that was a that was a big reason. No, that low key. And then with that low key, it built up to that though. So it was just like because she did that, right? They was in the garage. They was waiting. Uh, they was waiting to get picked up. You remember? So then, did, you, did you see the clip of them in the garage? When, so then, like right after De Niro cook kicked them out, that whole conversation. So then that's, that's when, what kicked the whole fight off. And then that's when uh, Lena and Cam, them, they had came back from the club. And then that's what caused Cam and uh, De Niro to come outside. outside. And then okay. they was talking. Oh, it's coming. I see it. Oh, yeah, come on. 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 Come on
Y'all What? We in. What are you talking about? We weren't even talking about it. Yeah, but I don't see it. That's why I said it's outside now. Yo, they said it's outside now. I bet you know that right now. She can't come back in, period. If she come back in, it's going to be a problem. Don't let her back in the grave. Come on. Don't make me go. Come on. Come on. Cause y'all like y'all about to be on some jumping shit. No, hell no. But Ooh, she swing on you. I'ma swing on her. Like, oh, so that's how it's gonna be. It's it's not not I got sisters. Y'all mad because it's I got two girls. We the only two talking. I got sisters. Y'all, y'all wanna set that shit up? I got sisters. Don't you talk about right here? What you talking about? No, cause y'all don't like that shit. Y'all don't like that shit. Y'all not gonna keep arguing with y'all. I don't know. Fuck y'all. Hey, cool. What's your name again? KG. What are we doing? Out here. Yeah, but look, this is what I said. You understand what no, no, I said? No, 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 look, this, look, look, when y'all came, okay, no, 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 no. That's why your ass not coming back in the house. I don't give a fuck. I'm not in this shit. What the fuck you talking about? What you talking about? I'm about to defuse the situation. And and De Niro. And that's what I'm saying. That's what led today. That's what led. So does that justify what I'm what I mean by she was? A, like a little messy in the crib, Andrew. So I'm, my question is, why did they say it was? They they DM'd her. Cam, Cam, Lena, and Liberty were the biggest names that they they were the influencers. The narrow isn't influencers. She didn't have she didn't have the the name the big name like motherfuckers with that. She was like a a motherfucker like, damn motherfucker, why you talking shit? You know what I'm saying? It was like a. It was. It wasn't like a she, like a motherfucker. That, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> no, she, cool. bro. I'm not trying to get on her. Like she not. You know what I'm saying? She cool. I'm trying to see what the fuck was everybody. <clears throat> Shit. So it's just crickets. It's just gonna be crickets. Like, stop, stop talking to hot shit in the house. And when she get on the floor, nobody fuck. I ain't been talking no hot shit in the house. All I said was motherfuckers had. Put you gave me the right? rundown. Like when we went out there, we was finna all squabble no together. Rundown. All I said was what happened yesterday. I told a motherfucker what happened yesterday, and I had a motherfucker get out the house. Period. I said motherfuckers been texting me all day. I ain't said I ain't shit. Cause I don't argue with nobody over the mo over social media. That that period and shit don't matter. You ain't fight with us. Like, okay. Hey, uh, that shit out of there. Shit. Ain't no, feel feel. ain't no one. Ain't no one. I think everybody feel like that though. Like I ain't gonna lie, you supposed to squabble somebody. Y'all talking to me like I was the only motherfucker that didn't. That didn't. You was hype. the only motherfucker that was hype. How was I hype? I didn't not, hype nobody head up. I you said, ain't hype nobody head up. Was, but I you was Shay, in here. I said Shay just texted me and said they asked his coach. Yeah, you was back and forth. Oh yes, girls outside it, and they like here. Yeah. You was supposed to fight for. Okay. So nobody else said nothing. Nobody else said what? I'm saying. Everybody else they said something was out there fighting. The same thing that I said when the girls I said the same thing everybody's been saying all day. She fought. They take you ain't fight. She ain't even the house. Okay. So we just gonna keep it a bug. You just ain't wanna fight. Okay. All right. We got 4K footage of uh, shorty motherfuckers like. If if you swing on her, she gonna swing on you. Cam talking about the narrow. Like they finna. You get what I'm saying? Me and Chris. <laughs> Y'all ever seen what's that girl name? Liza. Liza, what's what's her last name? Koshi. Koshi. Liza Koshi. She she's the new like funny girl that be doing all type of sh dumb shit. Yeah, you know man. Shit, I'm Chris going crazy. Chris Jackson, whatever you want to call it, superstar. You know? Yeah. But yeah, we just we, we just vibing. You know? Cool peeps. Cool. Yeah. And you just just so happen to see it on camera, so yeah. Are you taking her on tour? Do you I get one pick. Damn. Me a diva. Wait, what? Out of who? I got. <laughs> I got. I got to pick out of who? Who I got to pick out of? Who I got to pick out of? Uh, you don't matter. No, who you got to pick out of? Get a save the date, Pepper. Who I got? What? So if you had to choose between. Me? <laughs> now, what type of question is that? Get out of here! <laughs> Get out of here! No, I'm just playing. You my dog.
are you looking so hard? That's what I say. This cast be on some freak shit, bro. Nah, bro. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. No, it's you, bro. Stop. Here. Chief. Whoa. Chief. Whoa. And why you leaving? You good. Right. So, Eli, how did you find out that the world thought that you guys set the, set the fight up? When uh, the Messi Mosh post put all three of us on there and made it, made it seem like we had set it up, which... Hey, I don't know. I don't know why that was. I guess they didn't watch the show. <laughs> so, um, you know. Chris, I think you explained it earlier. It was the post that was screenshotted. Can you tell us more about that? Basically, with the with the Messi Maj post of them putting all three of us up, it was like, I think, I think, I think, the the cam the cam say that uh, I feel like we were set up. Ooh. I don't, I don't remember, it was somebody, I think, I think it was the girl, I don't know. I don't want to put nobody, put no words in nobody's mouth, but I think, it was, I think it was her, she said that we set it up, which we didn't. Why, why would they say that? Like, why would they say that? Um, I would say probably because they feel like, Shorty said, because Shorty asked the other girl, Nyjah, if I gave her a phone number out to, I guess, Lena and them. And I'm like, no. So because we knew her, and she kept blowing my phone up, trying to figure out who was the girls talking on the phone, which I never gave her any type of at names, no numbers, no nothing. I'm showing motherfuckers this, I'm like, hey, she blowing my shit up. Not once did I respond. So I don't know who the fuck Didn't said. Did you give the phone to Lena? Lena, I'm like, hey, she calling me. Lena, give me the phone. She said, hey, Lena, I, she took the phone and she put me on, did what she said, said what she said. So, mm -hmm. so right. They feel like, I, I, I feel like they, they, I feel like they feel like we set it up because, for one, you was recording. Boom. And, and without no context, motherfuckers would think that. Two, we knew one of the girls. So they would, motherfuckers would think, I could understand how motherfuckers would think that. And three, it was a lot of, it was a lot of adrenaline going on and a lot of commotion going on during that time. So minds were cluttered. So they still trying to figure out what the fuck just happened. So they just, you know, oh yeah, they do know her. Oh, oh, you, you on her side? Like that wasn't none of like that wasn't none of that at all. If if we go back to the 4K footage, since motherfuckers was like not in their right mind to remember what happened and how this shit escalated, you go back, you just see that that shit just got escalated from a lot of shit. Talking. Motherfuckers ain't show up, man. Cause I would like to hear, I would like to hear motherfuckers, you know, response to us. You know what I'm saying? What we got to say? Man, honestly, I don't fucking know. But I feel like motherfuckers should be running from shit. Stop running from the truth, goddammit. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna come out eventually. So, Chris, you tell us about your punch you in the eye? You said, mm -hmm. did, you, you said I told somebody to punch me in the eye? Yeah, because if they think y'all set it up, then you Right! So, wait, 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 wait. How do we set nah, it up if I nah. got punched in the eye? They thought that I got mad at the punch. And so they thought I wanted them, I wanted to sick them on the girl that hit me. Blood. They no. thought I wanted blood. I did not want any blood. The girl had enough blood drawn. I said bro, it was, I was right there like this. Oh, fuck. Yeah, oh, you, bro. Yeah, wrong time. You, if bro. If you watch the episode, you will literally see how it played out. I have one for Cam. So Ooh. viewers want to know, why did Wuda think that you and Lena had something going on? And how did that situation make you feel? No, nah, I don't know why he thought that. Like, you weird. I don't know why you thought that, bro. Like, I don't want her. She cool people. Like, nah, bro. That's not. Nah, I just can't. I just can't see us talking, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Like, she cool people, but I would never just talk to her. Like, would you think I want revenge, my nigga? No, I don't want her, bro. You good? Oh, cause you used to Who would Nah, nah, he ain't never talked to one of my girls. Oh. He's stupid. <laughs> he, can't, he, can't handle, he can't handle no one. <laughs> Crazy as fuck. Look at you! So, Nunu, how did you and Lena squash the beef after the water fight? Okay, 
So I was throwing water around, you know what I'm saying? But she threw some old lemonade that was sitting outside for, Garbage. With, wow. for three days long. It had spit in it, ashes in it, trash in it, like, like, like tobacco stuff in it, like just, it just was a whole conjunction of some shit. So, and you know, like, I don't know. So, yeah. So, how do we squash it? I mean, we didn't, we didn't even, we didn't talk about it. You know. We but y'all are good now. Huh? Y'all are good now. Uh. Yeah, yeah, we cool. I guess you know. I don't know. Mm. Looking back, is there anything the three of you would do differently on the show? Uh huh. Is there yeah, anything you would do differently on the show? Anybody? Oh, anything I would do differently? Anything we would do differently? Nah, we was we was in our own space. Like we wouldn't. Bother Shoot, I mean, let me see. I could probably record. Probably make some more content. Other than me, you know. I mean, that's that's for me. Getting to know everybody more. Yeah. Like, we talking to everybody. Yeah, because we, we didn't like talk to nobody. Like we talked to people, but like we didn't get we to know everybody. Own, like, like yeah, we clique. had our own little clique. Like when we was when we was talking, like we was talking to each other type shit about shit. Like we would we would have our own conversations in the car. Like why everybody was doing their own little thing. Like we would be dugged off basically, chilling in our own world. Okay, can you each share your favorite memory from the show? Oh shit, when me and Crochet was wrestling. Man, uh, was it any secret like uh, hookups that we didn't see that happened on camera? <laughs> <laughs> nah, not for me. Secret hookup? Yeah. What? <laughs> what y'all trying to say? I mean, hey. I mean, he, 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 he is one of he is one of the most. I mean, bro, so it like, was it was some secret link ups, but we ain't doing no name dropping. Man, like we, oh. we chilling. Like we, <laughs> I, shit, that's all I gotta say. I ain't gonna count. Shit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you gotta get ready, dude. <laughs> Who do y'all think was the messiest on the show? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I still haven't said my oh, favorite part. Yeah. So my favorite part was probably. Um, doing those challenges when and and we had won. No, no, no. When me and Debo, when me and Debo had played the little um, the little Jenga game, you know what I'm saying. And then I had came to clutch to win for the boys. You know what I'm saying. I'm gonna do it every time. And uh, yeah, that was that was a good moment right there because I came to clutch. Why was everybody treating you like that on the show? Everybody was against you. I I I, I don't know. I don't care, you know, so it's just them, I don't know. I don't be doing that to nobody at all, so. Mine was kind of the same, too. During the challenges, cup on, you know, I came in clutch for, for our team. Y'all ain't had to do nothing bad, for real. Yeah, yeah, he was going crazy on cup. Going crazy back to back to back. Oh, no, for real. Mm-hmm. That's it, though, for real. But yeah, though, like, I, I seriously don't know what be going on with with people, so, you know. Will Renee be on season two? Uh, Are you bringing her on season two? I mean, I'm not bringing her on, the, on season two. That's not my guess. So, um, but she will. She's, she's supposed to be coming. Okay. What's up with y'all? What's, what's the dynamic of that relationship? Uh, we're just friends, you know what I'm saying? You know, same bond we had a long time ago, but, you know, on some more mature shit. So is she uh, yeah, probably so. Most likely. Why did you lie about both names? Uh, I just, let me see, why did I lie about it? Oh, because that was my business. Um, <laughs> yeah, that was my business, you know what I'm saying? They said, do you like me? Wait, they said what? Whoa. Wait, they said what? <laughs> Chrissy, do you like me or something? Wait, 
Shout out Chrissy. Mm -hmm. And we turned up yesterday. You know what I'm saying? We had we, we threw a big party. You know what I'm saying? And uh y'all seen, yeah, wrote a wrote a clip, y'all, y'all go see it. And uh I filmed Motion Boy, we filmed Motion Boy video, you know what I'm saying? So y'all go see that when it drop. Uh, yeah. So I rated our boys and then EMG boys cool. Yeah. Yeah. No beat at all. She said no beat. <laughs> you better get ready, dude. You better get ready, dude. <laughs> we wanted to talk about the voting situation. Um, in a confessional, Chris, you, you expressed how you felt about somebody voting for Angel. And you was like, oh, I wish I could find out who did. And then I asked you, I was like, who do you think voted? You didn't even waste no time. You said it. So tell me what's what's going through your mind when you watch that episode and you see your boy voted for your girl. Yo, <laughs> I be trying to stay out there, little one too. They don't got nothing to do with me. But I just knew, like I just knew, knew, knew did. Like I just know he did. Like nobody in else in the house could vote her. I really thought it was one of the girls, cause <laughs> we ain't, like we didn't even say nothing to the whole to each other the whole time. So I'm like. Nobody really got a reason to vote me out but a girl, because girls do petty stuff like that. But, yeah, I don't think it was. That's just some PMG stuff, like, what? they got to hate. Like, <laughs> so, I would expect that from Nunu, so. It was Nunu. Okay, 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 so. What are you doing? <laughs> I just know, like, I do that with you. Turn up on me, <laughs> So, I seen her, and then I was just. Had to do so for the camera. I didn't want to be like, oh, I just turn around. So I just did some, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I did, did my little one too, real quick. I was chilling, really, the whole time. I barely was, well, when we was doing stuff, I was there, but when we was done with everything, I just go home with my man, chilling. So I was how worried about So how did, um, how did y'all get through playing the games against each other? I mean, he was trying to cheat the whole time, but. Who was trying to cheat? You was trying to cheat the whole time. Nobody to you were trying to cheat the whole time. He was trying to grab the freaking thing, put his foot on the thing, and then grab it. When he just said grab it, like, okay, but you know I'm right. Right? Manny. Manny was standing right there. And then y'all kept alternating the rules of the game. What rules? Every time we won, so I grabbed I grab the uh, poster or whatever, and I take it back to the base. We'll win. Now they say, oh, nah. The, uh, if somebody else touch it, now you can't pick it up. Because you started stepping on it to where nobody could pick it up. You weren't even picking it up. You were standing on it. There was no up. rules to say you oh, But if you were supposed to use it as a shield, so which we were. After I won, they said, now nah, I can't step on it because I won. <laughs> <laughs> Cause that's called cheating. So he said, pick, "He said, use it as a shield. You're standing on it. You, like, make it make I sense." Stood on it so you could grab that it. That don't make no sense. And then I grabbed it and I took it to the knees. Okay. So if you would have grabbed it and I would have grabbed it, what would have been doing? Y'all would go have to. Snatch it would have been whoever it. has a shield. Well, then I was gonna have to snatch it, and then y'all would go say, "No, no, no! Somebody else touch it. You can't touch it no more." It's the rules that's gonna keep on changing. So basically, you went in a room to wake them up. Mm -hmm. And who came, them two came out of the room together, right? Or you said no locked doors, you said something. Oh, oh, yeah, they were in the room together. Me? Me? Yeah. Yeah, they slept Y'all did right. sleep in the same room. Y'all did share. We slept in the same room. We ain't sleeping no same bed. Yeah, well, no, yeah, they, they were in the same room. Yeah, just like how y'all was in that one room with all yeah. on, on them bunk beds, yeah. He was on that, that top bed, and I was on that bed that pulled out. This ain't that. I'm like, because technically, in the room with the bump bed, it was two girls and two boys in that room. Eli and a girl, and what Jacob girl and a girl. Eli? What girl was Jacob? Eli in the bed? It was Eli and Jacob, and two girls was in there, right? Oh. Now let's be a hundred. Yeah. Right, wasn't it? seem like it was me and Debo. They trying to make it seem like it was me and Debo in the same bed. Wait, the narrow no, it was and that other girl. 
Yeah. We did our part. We did our part. I just kind of, I just kind of, now who I'm just saying, like, I do right, recall. Let's talk about, let's talk about it. So, who you, you, uh, <laughs> yeah, because y'all trying to make it seem like it was me and Debo in the same bed. No, we were in the same room. Y'all was doubled up on two separate beds. Who was y'all so in the me. bed with? See, I just had to lay my head somewhere. And yeah. I was just trying to sleep for real. I just laid my head down somewhere. Where I know I can sleep on the bed. You see, it's a bed. Where did you lay your head down? Who was the girls, bro? Yeah. Who was the girls? But we not speaking. I'm about to say about that. What the fuck? You trying to win? You said we not speaking. You not speaking out there. You came. Oh my God. Well, y'all. Nigga, it was Ashley. Cause this shit funny. Y'all try to y'all try to troll me. Y'all try to you know how to start something. But anyway, actually, it was KJ and him arguing. K, uh, no, not KG. KG, KG, and them arguing over the uh, bunk bed up top. And then KJ was still. It was like it was a bunch of niggas in there. KJ, I mean, yeah. KJ was on the floor sleeping. KG. No, no, I'm talking about KJ, the cameraman. Goddamn. He was on the floor sleeping. Goddamn. KG, he had left out because you done made him mad, all type of other shit, you know? And then. Exactly. No, y'all y'all try to play me in this bitch. I don't phone her. I ain't gonna go over there. Who trying to play you? Who trying to play you? Who trying to play me? Who trying to play me? I know. That's what I'm saying. So why y'all not? Why y'all can't say who was in the room? Why? It was, let me say the guys first. Okay. No, so it, it was, it was only two guys. And bro, you was lying. Look at you. Why you smiling and shit? Lying. Stop playing. You doing this for the camera. No, bro. No, no, no. Don't say that. Hold on. You so, niggas is lying. Run it back. See? This is the type of nigga you is. Nigga, it was KK. <laughs> so, so it's KJ sleeping on the floor. I was sleeping in the bed. <laughs> he was sleeping in the bed. What's going on here? Talk. Okay, okay, so who room was that? Y'all. All right, we was in all the girls' room. Cause all the girls, the uh, the girl with the mustache. I don't know her name. Lane. 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 You said the mustache. He said the mustache. Bro, I didn't even, I don't even know her name. No, no, we not doing no name dropping. Stop saying no mustache. Name dropping. Right. She was an old man. Look, he, he, you know her. Oh, yeah, you do. Yeah, yeah tell her name. Tell her. I don't even know the name. I don't know the name. So what happened? Why y'all freaking out? Matter of fact. The reason y'all don't want us to say the names, because I won't say it. Bro, y'all saying she have a mustache, well, though. Like, bro, <laughs> what, bro? Who I wants to say her name after saying that, bro? I didn't look at the girl. Look, I don't know if we were talking about the same What? Look. They asked who it was. Y'all freaking out. Just say Ain't the no, name. Why ain't nobody with him? Bro, it's the, it's the girl's so room. Bro, it's the girl's room. So it's only three rooms in that bitch. Angel room, Lena room, Fendi, they room down there. They they came first, they get the room first. The next room is all the small influences. All the small little gir
You see, it was a lot of people at the crib that had to lay. Oh, thank you. You was in the bed. You was in the room, nigga. Hey, hey, you said there was two people. He was in the room. He was in the room. KJ was on the floor. Why you didn't say KJ that was on the floor? I don't get no fuck. Y'all snitching up there. Hey, you said two people, didn't you? You said two people, right? I did. All right, bitch. Why the fuck KJ right here on the floor? And you was over there. What the fuck? He was on the bed too. No, 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 no. Yeah, I was in there. No, I'm not giving nobody the mic. He was in the bed, bro. He was yo, yo, in the bed too, yo. though. And KJ was on the floor. I'm not saying hell no. It was five, six some niggas in that bitch and two girls. Yeah. So which girl got? So some of y'all may have seen the post that Fendi made online talking about F Influencer City. Ain't no show without the stars. Watch out for who you call your friends. Does anyone know what he was talking about? Yeah, nah. Uh, he think he's a star. Mm. I guess he, I don't know. <laughs> he said he think he's a star. I don't think he meant nothing personal by it. He just, you know, people are mad, they say whatever, so. Could have been anything. I don't think too many people even was worried about that. Liberty stated that nobody's getting paid online. So how do you guys feel about that statement? Is it true? I mean... Everybody make their money off YouTube and doing the content in Influencer City, right? Mm -hmm. You made money from Influencer City, right? From doing YouTube, you have. You I mean, have, we all. I feel, like, I feel like a lot of us had a platform to make money off of it, but I feel like we were just enjoying the moment. Like when you enjoy the moment, nobody really want to pull out a camera, but we did have the option to record stuff. So basically, it was more so of the opportunity. She could have for me. She could have exactly. done the same thing too. Like everybody could have recorded right. got your content. Right. She was so focused on the drama. Said. She was on drama. She right. could have, but now she doing YouTube. You uh, could have been doing uh, that at the crib. Uh, it's just funny to me how people be like, "Fuck Influencer City and shit," but then keep speaking about it and keep bringing it up and trying to get the cloud off her. Of Stop talking about it if it's fuck Influencer City then. So what started Influencer City, and what are your thoughts about season one? So uh, I feel like it was basically like um, putting a, a lot of different influences that haven't really been, that are like friends that don't really collab a lot, like putting them in a house all together, regardless of the differences that they be having or whatever, to see if they can do content for amount of time and then you know it showed who can and who can't real quick you know what i'm saying so i feel like yeah it was just the opportunity to have a lot of people that do content together to see if they really can do content together and be living with each other and shit i was gonna be with everybody on this one roof yeah right. yeah it was like more so um it was given the opportunity for smaller influencers too um, collab with bigger YouTubers as well. Everybody working together, doing challenges, doing fun stuff. It was cool. And yeah, it's whatever you made it, so. Um, I feel like it lets you, sh it get, <laughs> the show got to show how everybody really act on camera because when we pick up the camera, we record what we want people to see. But like with you having the camera, Manny, or People just walking around, you living in the house, it get to really show how you act and your personality and how you really react to things without your own self recording. Like, I plan like for some people to be here for me to get some stuff off my chest, but none of that stuff went. Like, yeah, I just want to see like, I want to see like what Liberty was talking about. Like I ain't know what she was saying, so I just want the hug, like to come sit down and explain, tell me how she feel. We had the gloves on the table. Like, but we all in Houston. I'm going to catch her though. <laughs> but look, like Miami is eighty dollars. It's not spring break. Like, she not in Miami. How you listening to She just shot the book on my hairstylist. She is out here. So. I'm fucking dead. That's funny. Yes. That's she funny. just posted on Twitter, so. Yeah, she did. That's funny. So, yeah, so, so if you see her the yellow, like, what you doing? I'm going to punch her down. You, you like no talking? No talking. 
We didn't, she didn't did she didn't did all the talking like if oh she was to walk God. in here right now like just turn the cameras that way. Like, <laughs> no, I was just saying like she talked a lot of shit about me too on on the internet and shit and it's like what the fuck I do. Like everybody talking shit to me and I ain't do shit. And she said at our crib in our face, played this little role and then get around other motherfuckers and then act different, folks. I'm looking forward to tour. I'm looking forward to a lot of us coming together and expanding our like what we do. Like if we make music, if we want to be models or whatever, you know what I'm saying? I want us to expand all of that during us being together because we could all make it bigger because of this opportunity. So I'm looking forward to tour. I'm looking forward to some new faces too. This is very important. What camera what camera it is? This one? Alright. You better get ready, dude. <laughs> Right fucking now. Last thing. Uh, motion boys up on tour. Better keep up with your hope. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know you gotta go with everything. <laughs> hey, what's up, boy, laughing at? That shit, that shit I, I, what's up, boy, laughing at though? I, 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 I knew you was gonna say that. Bro, 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 you knew I was gonna say that. Oh God, oh God. You said motion boys up on the jet ski. He switched to that shit. Bro, it's mostly brought up in everything. What's the way? We at the club tonight, man. What's up? Most of us up in the club. Better keep on. Okay, Neil. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look, I hope y'all have fun season two. I ain't riding on the fucking bus with these motherfuckers. Hey, Milwaukee might be the biggest one. Just watch what I say. Let's bet. Any any city that anybody lives in. My city is gonna be the biggest one. I place any bet. This city not on. I'm gonna do it every time. I'm gonna turn up and Florence the city tour. You know what I'm saying? Meet and greet. Catch your boy Nunu in Louisiana. June 23rd. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> y'all ain't seen this side of me, man. I'm gonna turn up, man. It's a whole new year, a whole new me. I'm gonna turn up for y'all. I ain't seen y'all in I don't know how long, you know what I'm saying? We ain't been in tour in what a year. We finna turn up. Big bowl. See, man, I wanna see my fans. All of y'all better be out there. I already told y'all, when I come to your city, you better pop out. Cause we going crazy and I'ma have merch. Y'all ain't even seen my new designs, but y'all just gotta wait on it. And we gonna turn up like always. <laughs>